announced it was phase one then two and now we are on phase three as netflix i here dropped all the arcane season two reactions chibi give it to me i take back what i said they're not yeah. going to prison they're going under the prison <laughs> because you know for a fact now that arcane season two has been leaked in full like the entire season oh man like, Arcane is a huge project. Like, Arcane Season 1, fun fact. I actually reacted to Arcane Season 1 on my old channel. And those were the, one of the most popular videos in the beginning. And I'm like, it was, those are the first videos that I ever broke over 1,000 views. I remember when every other video was, like, averaging 10 views. Anyways, with such a big brand deal like this, League of Legends, like, Arcane, bro, like, this is beyond just Japanese corporations and Netflix. Something in Netflix is... Com like severely compromised and like what's gonna happen here now and plankton the movie as well associate with nickelodeon has been leaked in full. nickelodeon you know, nickelodeon ceo you know riot ceo you yeah. know all these anime company ceos etc they're going to take whoever is responsible for this around back and make like we thought it was just the anime leaks but it's like nah bro it's like multiple different corporations globally now just not in japan like we're going worldwide national make them disappear with a magic trick because straight up at this point it's not just millions we're talking hundreds of millions of dollars now that has been lost thanks to this leak it is absolutely way beyond anything i've seen in recent memory associated with leaks Bec has there ever been a leak worse than this because again before the standard leaks were like manga chapters but that's very trivial compared to what's happening now these are not just single episodes being leaked and these are projects like months down the road complete seasons worth of content being leaked because it's like already with what happened yesterday and what i talked about in my video was bad it's probably the worst disaster i've seen in at least the anime industry in a long time and now this on top of that this is just this is already what was an absolute shit cake just smashed with a giant freaking boulder on top of it it is just like netflix has been very silent for the last 70 or so hours since these leaks have been happening they probably shouldn't say anything. It's better to carefully, careful, because like, they're probably, because like if they, imagine this, right? Phase one. Phase one, dun dun dun, shit got leaked, right? If Netflix came up with an apology immediately saying, we're so sorry and um, we're on the, we're doing an investigation and we'll make sure this doesn't happen again. The next day, phase two happens. How stupid are they going to look? Next, and then they issued another apology saying, okay, this is really the last word. We got it undercover. And then the next day, Arcane gets leaked. See? It's, it's not in their... I don't think it's in their best uh, intentions to release this, uh, uh, some sort of apology or whatever uh, update right now. They need to be doing damage control and just make sure that this fire is like completely just down. No smoldering embers. No, no, no. They're making sure like everything is sealed. And once all the damage has been assessed, then they'll probably give a statement. Happening for anime. And now that Nickelodeon's being messed with, and now Riot is being messed with, yep. you know Netflix is not going to be able to have their voice silent. They're going to have to make a statement at this point. Because oh, now, they're no longer dealing with just a few bill, like million lost. Hundreds of millions are potentially lost now thanks to this overall leak. And the question I have to wonder myself is... What is going on? Is this a security breach? Is this... I don't know. Is this some fucking Joker Dark Knight shit? Where the Joker's like, every day you don't uh, accept my conditions, another series will get leaked. Like, straight up. Remember that Dark Knight shit, bro? Like, every day the Batman doesn't come out, I'm gonna kill somebody. It's a rogue employee uh, 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 an employee that was fired and somehow has access codes to net uh, like netflix and can get inside of it or whatever and they're releasing stuff early i mean obviously that's not a good idea they're gonna get pr prison time etc but it's just like what's going on here because now that netflix has remained silent for so many days and it's very clear now after the leaks that's happened today with arcane that i wonder if they know I wonder if they know how compromised they are. Like, they're aware of the potential other series that's gonna get leaked. Or they're completely in the dark. They're just like, oh shit. 
we have no clue what's gonna get leaked or they're like shit we did the damage um calculations and it's looking pretty bad and we have we're suspecting like six four series to get leaked or something and they're like she we're just gonna fucking wait it out i don't know that is now stretching beyond the anime industry it's going into nickelodeon and riot themselves associated with arcane this means that uh, this situation is definitely affiliated with Netflix because these are Netflix shows. Arcane is yeah. set to only release on Netflix. And the fact that it was leaked means that someone has access to this information, has access to these files, and they're able to release them. Now, there's a few theories that's been floating around for a while now, and I was slightly believing it, even if obviously it was just a rumor, speculation, there was no proof. Are we going into conspiracy theory territory? I think we're beyond, like, I think in phase one, I dabbled in the idea of potential leaks to hype up the pre-release of Dun Dun Dun, but now it makes no sense if the entire season's gonna get dropped. Like, that makes no fucking sense at all. Why? I, it, let's go into the conspiracy theory. I, I'd like to hear what Chibi has to think. One theory that people had, and I was yeah. kind of starting to feel maybe it might be the case, was that maybe thanks to what's happened as of late with anime, with localizers being replaced with, you know, AI translations. You think that, like, people are rising against the corporations due to AI and other things displacing the workers. Some workers banded together and they decided, fuck it, we'll do a last stand. Maybe? Maybe there was a disgruntled employee that was upset that they were going to potentially be replaced, and they decided to get back at, like, you know, the anime industry or whatever and, you know, release episodes. But Well, this is beyond anime, and now it's Arcane coming out, too, but, like... Maybe? Now that, like I said, it's stretched out into Plankton and also yeah. Arcane, I don't really think that's the case at this point. Now, what I have to wonder... Is it a security breach? I mean, even if it's not a disgruntled employee purely by the woke localizer shit, right? Even if it's not anime stuff, it could be just a disgruntled employee about Netflix overall as an organization and how they feel about it and decided to do this shit. I think that's still feasible, but again, we're fucking around with conspiracy tinfoil theories right now. These are most likely uh, not true, right? These are not happening. And someone pointed this out earlier today to me, and it's made me think a lot. There was a huge cyber security, oh. like, attack or whatever, like... True! This did happen! The IT outage due to CrowdStrike update. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember this. This was a couple weeks ago. A few weeks back, like, everything yeah, yeah. was down these old systems. A lot of people were probably unaware of that. I mean, I was unaware of it until the next day because, obviously, I didn't have anything associated with that. But a lot of systems and stuff were down. You can look it up on Google. And you can type in, like, large cybersecurity attack or whatever, you know, on the USA or something. You, you'll, you'll see that, like, a few weeks back. Someone said that it's potentially possible that when that happened, maybe someone got access to Netflix and got into it and stole a lot of information Could be. from Netflix. That is what I saw someone say. Now, once again, I don't know if this is true, no proof, etc. I don't know if Netflix... That's right, we're just capping right now, remember, all for fun. This was actually affected by it or not, but it is food for thought. There was a huge cyber attack a few weeks back, so, yeah, you, you, you can think about that. But anyways, with that being said, whatever the case may be, I have to wonder... Thanks to just this continuously happening, is my account detail safe? And I think this is what Netflix really needs to do now, is really tell its subscribers, people that are putting their account details, their information, debit, credit card information. For sure, private information, especially with payment information, that's pretty sensitive info. Like, uh, who knows if those are leaked already. Didn't Crunchyroll have an issue with that shit? Didn't they end up leaking their entire fucking user base? On their site, they need to tell them, should they worry? Should they change their passwords? Because now I'm like, if someone's hacked into your system and they're stealing all this and posting this illegally, is my debit card information okay? Like, do I have to worry? I would go out of the way and just replace all that shit if I were you. I, I'd be covering my own ass before letting a fucking random PR statement come out to say, and then say that. I would, I'd be going out of me right now. I would change that shit right now if I were you. You know, obviously people associated with Netflix should be aware of this. So the fact that Netflix has remained very silent for these past few days as this continuously gets worse and worse. And obviously Netflix should be aware at this point. There is no Duh. way you're telling me. And again, I still think this is smart of Netflix to stay silent. Because again, what if they issued an apology or some statement saying we got it under covers after phase one, then phase two happened? How stupid do you look, right? Even though Netflix is taking a huge L right now, 
I think the optimal decision right now is to wait for everything to uncover and then make a statement. Because like, if you do this shit right now, you, you come up with a, uh, a fast statement trying to get things under, uh, just trying to give people an update, that will get even worse. A multi-billion dollar company is unaware of the current situation taking place with all these shows being leaked. There's just no freaking way. I know they're potentially incompetent. I just, I really doubt they're that level of incompetent. There is no freaking way. So because of that, it's just like, you should definitely make a statement now at this time. I mean, obviously- By this time, I'm imagining like four separate revisions of the statement that they started drafting already with the PR team after phase one. And every day it's just like, ah oh, shit, a new something dropped with this arcane stuff this is definitely gonna force them to potentially talk about it now because you know riot they are not gonna be happy once they hear about this today you know they're not because this is losing them money oh yeah 100 percent. this loses the money not just because of let's say the fact of the premiere but obviously when stuff like this happens like with arcane releases a lot of stuff like for instance league of legends will potentially have special collabs or events within their game to celebrate arcane season two this happens with a lot of products and the fact that, you know, it's been leaked early, this is going to really mess with that overall initial premiere of Arcane Season 2 to, you know, go with the event potentially that happens in League of Legends if there is an event. So you can see where that affects the overall income and For money sure. of League of Legends and Riot in general because of what happened here alone with this series. That's in not including everything else that has be been leaked as of late. So I just, I want to be blunt with you, man. This is bad. It's this worse is than way, bad. way beyond what it's I think it would be a few days ago. Like, I've been covering this topic now at this point. I could see Phase 4, bro. I don't think we're done yet. I don't know any other Netflix projects. Do you guys know of any other, like, future Netflix projects that's been highly, highly anticipated, like Arcane? Like, just think about any potential new Netflix shit coming out. And those could be the next phases. Wait for the past three days. This is the third day. And honestly, I'm getting a little bit tired of making these videos on this. No, you're not. No, you're not. These, that's an easy 30k view, bro. Don't fucking lie to me, Chibi. We farming this shit. But at the same time, you know, I want to talk about it because it's, yeah. it's important to talk about. This is really important. And I want to inform all of you guys out there that watch. Chibi is uh, a very good person unlike me i'm just a shameless farmer here to just farm the downfall of netflix my content because i'm at the point where i'm worried if my account is safe with all this happening because this is clearly a netflix issue so all i'm gonna say is is that it's very clear that a lot more people are becoming aware of the situation arcane is now trending on twitter as well with the situation yeah i mean look at all this shit right even the explore tab right now actually that might be more specific to chibi and if it seems like a lot of the mainstream public is finding out now about uh, the current leaks that's been happening at Netflix. Because let's be fair here. Yes, anime is definitely a lot more popular in this day and age now. But I don't... Well, we would have to che like, check the numbers, right? What do you think is bigger? ReZero Season 3 numbers or Arcane Season 2? I'm not sure, but I think that I'm going to lean towards Arcane. Random just ballpark numbers. I, I think Arcane, the IP, League of Legends, the fact that it's English-speaking audience like across the globe, I, I think that is a lot more bigger than ReZero. I think that IPs like this is just generally bigger than anime, in my opinion. I don't know the numbers. I'm just, I'm just, just random, random guess. Who, maybe I'm wrong, but I, I feel like it's going to be Arcane. In 2024 than it was like four or five years ago. But it is still very niche in comparison to something like Arcane or other things. And so a lot of people might not be really aware of what's been happening for the past few days because obviously Don to Don, Ranma, and you know. Yeah, those are big in our bubble, right? We have a tiny bubble. It's not a tiny bubble, but this bubble compared to, I think, people who enjoy Arcane and play League of Legends across the globe, I think it's pretty insignificant size, right? That's why Arcane, this leak is going to be much more significant in terms of how bad the leaks looks compared to, you know, the phase one and two. No, we have like other series like Terminators, anime, etc., getting leaked. Some people might not be like uh, fully aware of those stories or series, etc. They might have flew under the radar. But now that Arcane, a high profile series that was talked about for months by pretty much the giant portion of the online community for a very long time. Yeah, this is not something that could be just- I just realized Chibi has a shirt that, call that says Tensai. Which literally means like genius or prodigy. <laughs> nice shirt.
just swept under the rug or a lot of people are gonna you know not know about a lot of people are gonna find out about this today so yeah i, I feel like a lot should i get a t-shirt that says messiah what kind of audacious t-shirt should i get god fucking kami i don't know I do want the Opai t-shirt. This is a random tangent. I want the Opai t-shirt from a One Punch Man, the one known that Saitama wears. Bigger YouTubers, way bigger than me now, are probably going to start talking about the subject. I'm going to assume probably as this continues to develop, you're going to have people like Asmongold, etc. Oh, yes. talking about this in the next few days, because this is absolutely insane stuff that's been going on. I hope to see more people talk about it. But, uh, yeah, um, overall, Netflix, you need to make a statement. At this point in time... Nah, they should not make a statement. Again, I'm speaking purely from damage control. Releasing a statement right now, maybe in a way that it, um, also... Because, uh, like, again, the main problem, in my opinion, is if they make a statement and more faces come out and how stupid they look. But if the statement uh, considers those future potential leaks as well, saying, yes, we are compromised and there's going to be future shit happening too, that, that statement's going to be trashed on, though. They're going to be like, wow, you don't even know? Like, what the damage control is? You know what I mean? It's just, it's just bad optics. So, they're already fucked. And if they rush something, they're gonna, they potentially even look more stupid. So, right now, just shut the fuck up. Just zip it, wait for it to die down, and then issue a public statement apology. Or just feign ignorance and say, we got hacked because of not something internal to us, but due to the cyber attacks. Remember the other article he showed? Maybe they'll feign ignorance. You need to let us know if we need to worry or change our account information because this isn't normal. If, you, if you're actually worried about your account information being leaked and you need Netflix to tell you that it's leaked to change it, go do it right now. What the fuck are you doing? What are you waiting for? Just, just go check. You have, you have everything to lose. Don't fucking wait. This is really not normal. It's not just one series, not a few episodes being leaked. We're talking about full Seasons. series of anime and now... Over half of Arcane being... And remember, Dan Dan Dan, uh, episode 7 to 12, that was assumed to uh, get dropped uh, after phase 2, right? I thought phase 3 would be that, but phase 3 is Arcane, so phase 4 is probably going to be the rest of Dan 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 Dan. Leaked. The question is, at this point, when is it going to stop? What else is going to be leaked, etc.? So we'll see. I'll leave it at that, though. Thank you. All right, guys. Please go give GB a like. Go check out his channel. And... Phase 4 is probably going to happen, and we'll be there for it.